My name's Amanda Manuel, and today we'll be going to the number one ramen place in all of Japan. Did we get here at 6 a.m.? Well, yes. Well, here. Am I excited? Yes. Is this my sixth time trying? Also, yes. But we are less than half an hour away, and I'm so excited. Is it going to be good? I have no idea. So, come along for the journey if you want. That's it. <laughs> it's 4 a.m. Currently, 5 a.m. And we're on our way to go do some ramen. And stand in line. I'm behind the camera with my friend. <laughs> we're on our way there. It's already recalculated one time. You know this place. I get lost every single time I try to get here. But we are here early. Let's go this way and then that way. We're here early, it's like six in the morning. Yeah, 6.30. So it's the earliest I've ever gotten here. The latest was 11. I guess the latest I got here one time was closed. But I think, I feel good vibes. Good vibes. Like I think we're, I think we're gonna do it this time. I'm excited, I'm excited. We're gonna turn left. Is there anybody? It's a red. We're running across the street. <laughs> we gotta beat people in line. Here's the 7 Eleven I went to when I went to the wrong restaurant. I don't see anybody yet, but it's it's gonna be like across and it's gonna be on like this side. Okay. I'm so nervous because there's so many times I've rounded the bend oh, no. and there's been a problem. Like, no one's there. Yeah. And I'm like, why is no one there? No one's there because it's closed. <laughs> but I feel it. I feel it in my bones. Like it's 6 a.m. Like why is why would there be people there? Why would it be sold out? Today is the day. Today is the day. <sighs> Just around this river bend. I'm so scared. Yeah. <laughs> why is there nobody there? Wait. <laughs> this is my door. Yeah. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Well, we're here. As you can tell, there's nobody else in line. We're pretty sure we're the first ones, but we're not like entirely sure. <laughs> so what's happening right now is we looked online and it said something along the lines of like a first come, first serve basis. And nobody else is in line. So I think that means we're like the first ones, but through those little slits right there, you can like see the dude who's cooking. And I definitely made eye contact like this. And he did not give me a thumbs up, but I also didn't give him a thumbs up. <laughs> so that's what we're working with. So we're gonna stand here for five hours until he tells us to leave. And you're not supposed to film in there, so you might not even get to see the woman. But I didn't say that. Well, I'm gonna try and sneak a peek. Do you have any thoughts? Other than us getting here five hours early no we're gonna be fine we have drinks we have snacks we have games so if you're not here then you're wrong i guess that's <laughs> really it <laughs> this is why we came here cheers mm. this is good it's like horseradish wasabi yeah uh, but definitely this is why I think wasabi should be added to sandwiches. It's good. Mm. We have been in line for approximately, sorry, I had to see if my mic was working. <laughs> We've been in line for approximately two hours or so. I'm taking a little break right now. The sun has come. So we're sitting like right over there. The sun has come over the buildings and is like directly in our eyes. So. We were like swapping in and off. She went and got some snacks, went to the bathroom, came back, and then I was supposed to go to the bathroom, but um, someone was in it. So I decided to come over here and kind of tell you my thoughts about like what's happening so far. I am currently headed to 7-Eleven right now. Like I said, that bathroom over there was full. Full? There was somebody in it. 
Um, and I'm just, let, I'm hiding from the sun is what I'm doing is I have to use the restroom. I think I might buy a little coffee and then I'll just go back in line. Right now it's literally three people in line. Me, my friend, and some guy who, who walked up so quickly behind us, I thought we were under attack. Like I like squared up, like he, he was facing me and behind my friend and he walked up so fast. He was like this, he was like this, he was like this, watch, watch, watch. I, I thought we were under attack. And this was me. I squared up. I was like. And then he just stopped and then just like got in line. And I was like, oh, yeah. This. People come here. Other people come here, too. It's not just like me. But I'm really excited to finally get to eat at this restaurant. Like, six times. Six times I've tried to come here. Like, that's insane. And every time I have been, like thwarted in some other way some way or another and I'm like nervous like what's gonna happen this time <gasps> like why what's gonna stop me from being able to eat there this time like we get there and it's sold out but we're like the first ones to even step in the restaurant it's already sold out like what what's the vibe what's the vibe what's the vibe but I'm actually I'm like really 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 excited I am oh it was so funny me and my friend we were like watch us go and it's like not even that good like we sit down and we're like, could have got ramen at 7-Eleven. And we were here at 6 a.m. But I think that's like the fun of it. The fun of this trip is not the food. It's the journey. The fun part is the journey along the way. It's standing in line with your friends and playing Would You Rather. Like that's the fun. I really mean that. I do mean that. But that's like what every little white girl says. It's not about the destination, it's about the journey. It's time for me to get 7-Eleven. <laughs> Who do you flick in the city when I'm not there? <sighs> There's nothing better than a 7-Eleven coffee. Like... This feels like it's propaganda, but it's not. This is like bitter, bitter coffee. Like when it hits my bloodstream, I feel like it's awakening me. Like I feel like the awakenness has begun. I have so many memories in this cup. Like when I take this sip, I'm not tasting black coffee. I'm tasting like adventures. I'm tasting like waking up at 3 a.m. to go for a drive to go somewhere you know what I mean like I'm tasting that thrill of like Japan of like of wonder of you're gonna see something new I'm tasting new in here which is just so dramatic <laughs> kind of like a comfy cool sore you know what I mean some people would like kind of call me like a cringe connoisseur too you know just to go just to go out here Within Hobes, can you see I'm like side eyeing you? All right, let's go back to line. <laughs> There's a line now. Did it take a long time? I'm really bad. <laughs> No, I it, went on my own side quest. No, I figured you did. I was like, oh, she's she's out adventuring. We're in Tokyo. It's Saturday. I like already. Hours. I went to like Shibuya Crossing. Oh no! I got on a train. I left. <laughs> you like yeah, like I went at the shop and like whatever. I got a coffee. But... No big deal. Won, I like... stood in a different line. Like <laughs> <laughs> it's great. I tried Tokyo's best coffee. It was mad. I am happy. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> and it's only like eight. Yeah. How are those? Really good. Mm, yeah, I know. I'm learning to tell the truth. I'm also learning how to lie, but I'm learning how to tell the truth at the same like, time. Say no? Yeah. <laughs> when women can't say no. It's okay, ladies. You can say no. <laughs> <laughs> is it connected? Layer one, down. This is me now. Do I have a long sleeve shirt underneath this? Yes, this is a long sleeve. Do I have shorts or pants underneath this? Yes. Is it almost 70 degrees? 
Also, yes. How's the weather? What do you have to say for yourself? It's really warm, and I told you about the forecast, so I would like all your followers to know. <laughs> but I was ready. That's all I can say. <laughs> it is 8.10. We're happy. We're about to eat ramen. It could be mediocre. We don't know. But we're here. What's your, what's your biggest fear? Dying alone? <laughs> what am I supposed to say? Pretending like I didn't ask her to hold the camera while I took this off. <laughs> Strip! <laughs> well, it's out on the town. <laughs> that? That's the sun. And this is what it's doing to us. Look at all of us. I don't know if you can see it as well as I can, but this was squished at the bottom. There we go. This is at the bottom of my bag. Me worried that maybe this is not gonna be super good ramen. Also me, willing to eat this. Right? Right. Right here. Right here. Like my standards are on the floor. No, they're like basically in front. So they just came by and there's we told them there's two of us and they're gonna open at 10.30. Also, repeated conversation, but I said, um, I just got done with my sandwich. So like watch, watch us sit down and I'm not even that hungry. I would leave. And then I was like, watch me be, sit down and be like, uh, can I get this to go? Freaking Taurus. <laughs> Taurus, you're the Taurus. Tourist, but I am a tourist. <laughs> I just can't believe it's time. Like that, that, they, that they actually just they came by. Like it's, it's happening. It's happening now. It's almost like this is my reality. This is your sixth time trying. Right. So this is like. I feel like we're gonna. Like, Let me show the line. I just feel like we blacked out a little bit. Like I can't believe we're here. How like long had, how long has been the line? We've been here since six thirty. So Seven, eight, nine. Yeah. Two and a half hours. So we had to get up early. She got up at two. Look at everybody back there. They made it too. Good for them. I'm so excited. The sun is still moving. There you are. So I'm trying to get it. Oh yeah, and also, that's the line now. Arg, 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 arg. We are at an hour and a half left. Easy, 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 busy. It's basically two minutes. <laughs> <laughs> but I am ready for this sun to like move past the building and then just not be sweaty anymore. All right, we have made some progress. We have officially ordered our fir our meal. So she called us in, we went in, we ordered. We both got just the classic ramen, nothing too fancy. Um, just like literally the reason we came here. Like that is what we got. He had a new specialty, but we were like, nah, 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 that's not us. That's not us, we just want the classic. That's why we're here, for classic. So we ordered and the waitress was just so nice. She was so nice, chit chatty. And then it was beautiful inside. It was really nice. I wish I could film. I don't know. I was a little scared to walk in and be like, here it is, guys. So I'm going to take some sneaky, sneaky shots later. But if you end up seeing just pictures, just know I tried. I stopped to go to the bathroom real quick. We have approximately a half an hour left. Yep, I'm gonna show you what the front of this building looks like. Since you haven't seen it before. There's the rest of the line. So, I've got my ticket in my pocket. And they already know what we want, so you literally just have to sit down and eat. Really excited, it's 10 o'clock. They're opening at 10.30, so. Hopefully I can film. Hopefully I can film. We're gonna practice how we would secretly film if we were to secretly film. Okay, go. <laughs> it's so awful. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. T minus two minutes. Two minutes, two minutes. And my back hurts and we've been standing. I'm ready to sit down. I'm ready to eat. Am I hungry? Are you hungry? It might be I think it's time. 
give me your last thoughts. I hope it's everything we dreamed. I'm hungry, we're tired, but it's gonna be ramen time. We were in Tokyo. <laughs> That's my final thoughts. Same. I know, I already know it's gonna be worth it. Like, I already know. Yeah. I already know. Yeah, there's no way you can't. <gasps> he just put up the flag, it's happening. It's happening! Ginza Hachigo, what I like to call my white whale. As I've stated many times before, I have chased this restaurant for five months. To sit here right now is an accomplishment in its own and an experience in its own. But like, let's actually talk about the ramen. The ramen is art. That's what it is described as. That's what they're going for. The way it's delicately placed in the bowl, the way that it looks. Their goal is to enjoy a cup with all five senses, with attention to detail and to deliver a ramen that is new, but somehow nostalgic, which is absolutely insane that that's what they're trying to do. Because while I was eating this, I literally looked over to my friend and I was like, I've had this before. And she's like, well, what do you mean? And I was like, I've tasted this before. This ramen, it tastes like my mom made it. Like I, I have had these flavors before and I couldn't pinpoint it. It literally had nostalgia written all over it. We just got out. <laughs> what were you gonna say? I was gonna say, it's crazy that we waited literally five hours for 15 minutes. Oh, it took us like 15 minutes to eat we that. We ate that so fast. I, I don't think like, I've, I was literally thinking that. I, and when I was eating it, I was like <coughs> yeah, we Well, because it, there was no talking. No. Not that it wasn't the, it just wasn't the vibe. Like it was like beautiful, right. like actual Green. angels like <laughs> Singing. Talking. We were the only ones talking. And not that it, not we were just, just kind of, right, we were just kind of like, oh, 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 oh. okay. But what do you think? Broth, really good. Okay. Cool. Okay. But this is controversial. It's not controversial because I feel the exact same. Because, like, I feel like you could get that pretty much anywhere. I, I'm not going to say that. Mall ramen's better. Oh! No. No. Okay. No. Okay. No. No. Okay. I didn't say that. Look. Like. It me. was good. And maybe the ramens we have sometimes, maybe they're like actually to add some packet to it. Like yeah. maybe it's not home fresh. The ingredients were better. The ingredients the were much. Amazing. The pork was g good. I didn't care. Here's the thing. This is almost the. Oh, this is the line that we did. Remember, you know my video? Yeah. This one. This is the one that went into the wrong line. Okay, so here's the thing. I don't. I don't get it. I don't get it. Like, I, that sounds like they were so nice. They, they were, were so nice. nice. They were so just welcoming. Yes. Very professional, very lovely, very, the main road's right here, and then okay. we'll just like start walking. Okay. I want to go to the Imperial Palace, go we'll walk the outside yeah. a little bit. Yeah, yeah. Um, the service was great. The service, the service was, was great. great. It was great I, am I glad we went? Am I glad we did this? Yes. Okay. But I would give it an 8 out of 10, and that's all I'm going to say about that. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> I wouldn't go again. No. I wouldn't go again. Not for the wait. Not for the wait. I don't even think I would go if there was a five minute wait. And that's controversial. That's a little controversial. Is that too much? Well, yeah, because it's better than that. <laughs> okay, here's the thing. There is this ramen in Kamakura. Kamakura in Kamakura. It's uh, called Ginza Ramen. I talked about it in my last video. Right. Far superior. I mean, I haven't Far had it, I superior. Know. Like. Okay. But I, I feel so bad saying that because I feel like they're gonna see that the, the, the owner's gonna see this video and feel so disrespected. But they were so nice. They were so welcoming. And then the food, the quality, like everything was good. I just thought it would be more than that. I just thought it would be more than oh my doggy. I don't know. It left something to be desired. Right. Like, yeah. I needed more. Right, right. More. I need him. I don't. I don't know how to describe it, because I feel like a hater. You know, 
but what? it just was okay. And I feel like sometimes the depth of flavor is kind of meant for the chefs of the world. What? Like the That's it. I, I am not qualified to eat there. Yeah. That's it. Michelin star who? Not me. Not me. So overall, was this trip worth it? Would I go to this restaurant again? Mm, no. Honestly, probably not. But would I stand in line for another five hours with a coffee in one hand, the sun blaring in my eyes, and, you know, the air full of giggles? Yeah. You know I will. Because the time I spent with my friend was so much more important than what the actual destination was. So, would I do this again? Yes. Thanks for watching. I hope to see you in the next one. Bye.